Most CFD brokers would shy away from responding to these kind of questions due to legal liability. However, contracts for difference are just another way of trading on the stock market, so large profits or losses are always possible. In short, anything is possible, but likely is a totally different story. What's a lot more likely is that you'll be wiped out in fairly short order if you get into CFDs with the idea of making instant riches. Trading with the expectation of generating a million or any specific amount is dangerous. If you are focused on a need to make a certain amount of money, such as a million pounds, this may in itself put you at a disadvantage, as it would make you prone to trading in desperation and or taking too much risk. Instead of focusing on numbers and instant riches, start by gaining the experience you need. Trade on paper or demo accounts first, and then start with a small amount of money with the goal of generating a consistent profit no matter what the amount is. Then you can gradually increase your trade sizes. We'd also suggest you read the book Market Wizards. There's lots of stories of people who have made huge success on the markets, and you'll find they all exhibit similar traits. People who lose large amounts of money also tend to have similar traits, like a lack of self-control and letting emotions interfere with their trading. To make your trading account grow, you will need a lot of discipline, patience and time. You need to understand risk and learn how to buy stocks low and sell them at a high price, or the reverse, if you're shorting them. I would advise you to find a mentor who has already done it and follow them with dedication. It's actually a bad idea to make a lot of money quickly from trading because then there's a real danger that you'll end up getting overconfident and lose all that you've made and more. You need to find a trading strategy that suits you and that gives you an edge over the 50-50 odds that you would have if you just randomly enter trades.